DVD is from a camera mounted above the training pool. It has the date and time running in the corner. Easily altered. Furthermore, the Moore's family and staff all swear Brian was at home, and I have affidavits. I'm sure you do. So, unless you're charging my client, we're done here. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Raines, what grade is Jay currently in? Fifth. So he spends, what, six, seven hours a day at school? About that, yes. And I take it he doesn't need to be breastfed ten times a day, his diapers changed, or to be watched every waking hour. You don't think? I mean, what do you think he's going to think of you, using a little boy to live off a woman you divorced nearly eight years ago? Objection badgering. Rephrase. Are you not at all worried what your son is going to think about what you're trying to do here? And that's when I realized that by slapping the flute, you fuse melody and percussion. <laughs> God with Maya, he's a major perv. And we're back. The next item is this antique pony saddle and leather riding crop. Mine, mine, I'm over here, right here. Feel this leather. That's got a sting. <laughs> Tucker, would you get me a drink? You command, I obey. <laughs> Mel Ellis. Visiting? Curtis, where have you been keeping yourself since we passed the bar? Working on a little venture I like to call my own firm. Damn, you started practicing when I did. Membership has its privileges. I'm going to make him do a rug dance, Colonel, and stick him in the brig with bread and water. This is a young man who made a young man's mistake. Now, it's my intention to scare him into never making another like it. But if I drag him into a courtroom, I'll damage him forever. Look, I don't know what that bitch told you, but I'm solid. She's lying to you. Call him off and, and let's talk about this, all right? Give me a chance to explain. This isn't enough. I'm not safe in here. Hey, buddy. He can get me in here. I'll go call social services. It's not enough. He can get to me. I need to ask you questions about Randy Jefferson. Wait a minute, hold on. This is my office. I don't have to talk to you. Sharon, call Mitchell. No, call the police. He may be executed tonight. Look, I told you on the phone that was a long time ago. It's over. I'll come back. No, hold on. Damn, will you turn that off? That was a client. Mr. Kuberman, I have a client who may be dead tomorrow. That's not my fault. I got no choice but to end this. I have to kill this man. How are you feeling? I'm hanging in there. Your temperature's going up. We should go back to the hotel. And then what? They don't have any real doctors here. <laughs> We're gonna fill the suit with a super oxygenated fluorocarbon emulsion. I know it's completely counterintuitive, but just try to breathe normally through your mouth. <laughs> I wonder why tourism's down. George, George, George of the jungle. Everybody. Come on and rescue me.